kitchen with a new face. This is Derek Delesh, who uh, mixes a mean drink over at Zite House. So I hear. I've been told. <laughs> and today we want to talk about this blackberry tequila teeny. Correct. Basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some blackberries. I'm going to muddle in blackberries with some jalapeno. Ooh. It's going to add a little kick, but I okay. think you'll be all right. Okay. We're going to add a little agave nectar for some sweetness. We're going to add some Avion Reposado tequila, some Frangelico, little lime juice, ginger ale. We're going to go from there. Okay, well, let's build so, this. All right, well, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add two fresh blackberries. I'm going to add one fresh jalapeno. And you leave those little seeds and the whole thing, so it, it, but everything else is going to... We're going to strain it a little bit, okay. but it's going to, you know, it'll be in there. So, and we're going to add a little bit of agave nectar. It's a sweetener, so sometimes a substitute for sugar or honey. I like that. I, I, I've used it with, I mean, things that I cook with, like breakfast and smoothies and things like that, but I never really thought about it in a drink. Yeah, so and we're going to help muddle this here, and what that does is breaks up the fruit and adds a little flavor, releases the juice, so uh -huh. you really get the full effect. So I'm going to add a little ice. So, and then we're going to take a little Avion Reposado. I'm not very smart when it comes to liquor. That, that's the tequila, right? That is the okay. tequila. <laughs> um, Reposado means it's been aged for a little bit, okay. not terribly long, about two months to one year in an oak barrel. Oh, then we're gonna that's add a tequila little, too? This is Frangelico. It's a hazelnut liqueur. Oh, okay. So it uses that. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this. And while you Give it a little shake. <laughs> Terry's Pavlovian response when she hears the shaker. <laughs> We're going to add a little lime juice, add a little ginger ale. Here she comes. Dogs I heard you. <laughs> she has the and... <laughs> If I wasn't speaking the truth, it wouldn't be as funny. <laughs> so it's and all we in are going to add a lime for garnish, and that is our blackberry oh, tequila teeny. Oh. So one of the new drinks that we have to offer, we have a new... Uh, Take a sip. We've got our new drink book. I know you love the sham board, but it has. The, I got scared by the the uh, what the, do you call the seeds? The seeds. The seeds. The seeds it'll add a little. It'll add a little spice, nervous. but it's nothing but I don't think drinks, you can handle. She, what's the, was the cranberry martini mm. that you make at home? No. Oh, the raz, the dirty raz, the dirty raz. Oh, that's got a bite to it. That's good, isn't it? Oh, like, you got to try that. With the spicy. The, the spicy. Mm -hmm. I'm scared. Yeah. We've okay. actually we have five spice cocktails that we feature now uh, as part of our new drink menu. We've got some new wines. We're doing half-off wines, bottles every Monday and Tuesday at okay. all four locations in the Valley. So uh, we got some new skinny cocktails, very popular. Everyone's trying to watch their figure, save a calorie I or two. I tell you what, they made a little logo with a red girl that looks all skinny, and now right. every woman in America wants a mm -hmm. I'll take it skinny. Yeah, yep, you yep, know, yep. I, I, I don't think it really matters. I don't really think it matters because you know what? We see you eating all of the chips and salsa, what? like by the basket. Yeah. That's the third basket, yeah. but they're drinking the skinny cocktail. You don't have skinny <laughs> chips and salsa, do you? We're working on that. Okay, all right. So, you know what's really interesting about this is that that's that, that, that taste of that spicy, mm -hmm. sweet, and salty. And it's really unique. You have to try that. I I've will. Never, I've it's never gonna... tasted anything like that before. Like I said, it's brand new to us. It's very popular. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, it's very good. Yes, it is. Now, um, it was so cute, oh, Steph. Oh, it's good. <laughs> you didn't see, but when you when you were talking about the the type of tequila, mm -hmm. and you said something about what aged in a barrel or mm -hmm. something. Aged in oak barrels. Everybody's like, oh, they're like, yeah, he got it. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> you had a little fan club. Score one. Good deal. <laughs> good, good, job, good deal. Good job. All right. Well, okay. this is the Veracruz that we finished up in the last segment. All of these are part of uh, the menu right now. It's ever evolving over at Z Tejas. If you haven't been out there recently, it's time to go because everything's new and delicious. And of course, the classics, they can't change because I haze them too much. Uh, right. I hope not <laughs> so. because that's why we go there. <laughs> All right. Hey, you know what? Tomorrow, wedding day. Oh, that's right. Yep. Joy is getting married. <laughs> no. Again. <laughs> How many years now? 27? 28. <laughs>